Fraser, Jack Escott, two Phantoms development players, Alex Padalek, Jarvis Hunt, another development player, and 97, Nathan Long. Our referee tonight is Richard Belfit, and we have linesman Marius Cabal and Phil O'Neill. Looking now at the league table, we can see at the moment, uh, the table actually needs updating, but we'll cover that shortly. Um, it's currently at the moment both Bees and Phantoms on 25. Bees at the moment just above us, and then Swindon currently on 27. Uh, tonight's result really is going to settle who is actually on second, really, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Um, it's, we've had you guys have been involved in another cup competition. We haven't, and I think that's why we have so many games in front of everyone at the moment. Antonov looking to clear it out front, goes across in front, shot deflected, sticks loose in front, goes over the top of Ma, and that's goal. Looks like that will be Antonov, judging by the face occasion side. So we see the shot goes across, rebounds off White. First shot goes off the pad of Ma, it comes back again, and I think could actually be Doughty gets that one. So we'll just watch it again in slow motion. Puck coming round the back. Goes across the front. Yeah, Antonov misses. Doughty gets the first chip. Smith gets the second. And it's Doughty that puts it away. Bruglis picks up. Waits for everyone to clear. Jarvis Hunt back front four. Jarvis Hunt with a fantastic goal. Jarvis Hunt picks up the puck from Callum Bruglis. Backhand, forehand, backhand, goal. So here we go. Hunt takes on backhand, forehand, forehand just goes block aside low and beats skins underneath. So here we go. Bugles stops, looks for his options. Bounces off of the skate of Harvey Stead and it's picked up by Jarvis Hunt. Just that's a beautiful goal. Backhand, forehand, geeks the player, puts it away. So, less than a minute after the B's score, the Phantoms equalise. Sisters, back round centres. Went loose in front and it's in. Looks like it's going to be Scott Robson or James White with that one. Let's have a quick look at the replay to see. That might have actually been put in by one of the B's. So let's just watch here. Martin Sisters on the puck. Plays it back to Norton. Norton to Robson. Robson takes a shot. We see it bounce out. Robson goes to take a shot, but it looks like it's actually put in by one of the bees. Long stretch pass to Ryan Watt. Ryan Watt goes in. Looking for an option. Shoot! Ryan Watt. Ryan Watt left pretty much unmarked there and uh, managed to put it in, block aside low. So Ryan Watt goes round, his man leaves Billing standing. Nathan Long just not committing enough. Watt just turns, shoots. And there we go, block aside low above the leg pad. And it's now B's two, Phantoms two. With five minutes gone in the second period. And there it is. So, great shot by Ryan. Just goes in, gets over the blue line, chips it in. Phantoms go for a change. Padalek's now got it, he's got some space, shoots, and it's a goal! Glove side high! Nathan Pollard did well to hold on to it, got it into the corner, bounced out to Padalek, and Padalek there just got some space. He's about to be pressured by Stead, just looks, shoots, glove side high, literally over the shoulder, over the left shoulder of Dean Skins. And out we go. So, B's there. It will probably go as unassisted. As B's touched it last before Padalek. Padalek turns. Shoots. And there we go. Just around the side of Ben Painter. It's one of the Phantoms goes down. Biglis picks up. Sisters on the far side. Sisters looking to celebrate with his stick. The stick's gone. But that was a fantastic shot there, went over the blocker side. So it's the panic to the opposite side. Skins not even registering it, it was there. 
And that's it, Phantoms 4, Bees 2. So it's the panic, you see on the slow motion, the panic takes across the line, cuts Robson out of the middle completely. Suster's there with the shot. Skins trying to get his arm up, but block a side high, probably the hardest way to stop anything. And it's Phantoms 4, Bees 2. So, Bees look to make a change in net minding. Dean Skins, very unhappy at coming off, but on goes Danny Milton. Robson to White. White plays it into McEwen. McEwen now behind the net, waiting for the Phantoms to get their positions for power play. McEwen to Panic. And a huge shot! Sorry, I didn't even have time to arrange that. Martin Susters on a great setup by Peter Stepanik. The Phantoms take a three goal lead. So Stepanik plays it across to McEwen. McEwen plays it far across to Susters, who one times it, goes glove side high. And that's it. Phantoms five, Bs two. Bs now looking to... Uh... Weldon now takes it out. He's got Nags with him. James Frora round. Norton with a slap shot. Redirected. We need to watch that. That was a redirect. Looks like it went off Nags. Beats Milton low five hole. So shot goes off Norton. Nowhere near. Hang on, no, we need to see that again. Because something came off. So, Billing out to Norton. Norton with a slap shot. Oh, it's a loose piece of tape. And then it goes, block a side low just above the pad. So, Tom Norton with a blue line howitzer of a shot. I actually thought it had been deflected. I'd, I'd seen the tape. Linesman getting in the way. But now Weldon goes in. Weldon looking for the backhand. Just holds it back. He's got Pollard on one side. He had White on the other, White turned out by Glatzy. Big shot, and it's Nathan Long. Cracking shot from Nathan Long in the blue line. Takes a bounce and just skips over Milton. And the Phantoms get number seven. So here we go, White there, loose it, goes to Long. Long, one time, takes a bounce in front, and then it goes block aside low. So we just see White being turned inside out by Galaxy. Still manages to turn to pick it up. Long with a one-timer. And in it goes. I don't think there's a deflection on the way. So that should be Nathan Long's goal. Mar just turning it away nicely. But he's looking for another option now with Sean Thompson. Thompson there rebounds off the blocker of... Uh, I just rebounded off the blocker of Mar. Thompson picking up his own rebound. And a great goal from Sean Thompson. So we'll just watch that again. So it goes across for the bees. Goes into the model, Thompson. Into the middle, Thompson turns. Goes for the shot, comes off the blocker. And Thompson, it doesn't actually hit the ice before. Thompson hits it again and puts it straight past Mar. So with just over one minute remaining in the third period, bees cut the deficit to four with a Sean Thompson marker. 